It was designed in part to help fishermen who lost their livelihoods because of the oil spill. But now BP is scaling back the Vessels of Opportunity program. And Channel 3's Laura Hussey talked to one captain who was let go without warning. After 44 days fighting heavy oil far offshore, the charter boat Sunrise was suddenly and unexpectedly dismissed. Well, we actually got word that we were deactivated secondhand through some shrimp boats. And it was I came home and about three days later I got official word from BP that uh, for the first time in my life I've been fired. We've got, I know, eight boats on this dock that have come back. At least 14 boats have been sent back to Destin Harbor. Some captains say the total is as high as 30. A BP representative says the company is drawing down the Vessels of Opportunity program across the Gulf Coast because they say there's less oil to clean up. But Sunrise Captain Kelly Wines disagrees, saying the problem is huge. It was disappointing to come home because I felt like there was a lot of work left to do. He also says the wrong people are being sent home. When I come home and I get fired, and there's private yachts working that have never made their living out of the Gulf like we have. And there's shrimp boats, commercial boats, charter boats, head boats laying at the dock idle. It gives me a bad taste in my mouth. Wines is talking to BP and hopes to go back to work. In Destin, Laura Hussey, Channel 3 News. A BP representative says the Vessels of Opportunity program was restructured last month to give preference to fishing boats. 89 vessels from the Destin fleet are still working for BP.